the Spinner open house and we're about to tell you about one of their most successful five axis machines that they bring to market. On this occasion, they've added automation to it, but we'll tell you a bit more about that later. Robin, tell me about this model then. Yeah, as you said, U5630, it's actually U5, but the U630 comes in different axis configuration. Here we have it as a five axis machine. U stands for universal, um, 630 stands for the X stroke, um, yeah, uh, you're right. Uh, this is uh, one of our most successful uh, machines uh, over the last year. So why? Why is it? Why is that? Why is that? You know, number of reasons. Uh, we have it available with so many options. So for every application, you will find the right spec. Um, we have it with uh, different spindle speeds, with different ATCs, with automation options, with different controls. So the cust our custom customers can spec the machine uh, really to their needs. Um, the, the accessibility of the machine is really, really good, which makes it uh, very easy for the operator to set up the machine. And it's just more fun to operate it when you, you know, can access the machine easily. Walking around your event here, I'm hearing that quite a lot from customers. The accessibility yes. into the machine is so important. Yeah, it is so important because, you know, if you, have to, if you have to climb into the machine and maybe hit your head and something like that, that's not fun. You know, nobody wants to, to work with a machine like that. Um, if you make the panels adjustable like we do, if you make big door openings uh, with doors that are easy to open and easy to close, it makes it so much more fun to operate. Absolutely, and you've got the machinist in mind. Yes. Okay, let's go technical on this as well, yes. about this setup, because you've got a trunnion table here. Yes, we do. And it's actually a very strong, very precise table. Really unique about this is um, that we are not, not only have one bearing set for the table, but a second one in front of the table. So this makes it possible to load big, big work pieces on it with up to 500 kilograms. That's about 1,100 pounds uh, work piece weight on that table. It's half a ton. Wow, yeah, that, yeah. That, that's a lot. Yeah, that's a lot. Um, and tell me more about the spindle then. Yeah. So in, in this machine right now, we have a 15,000 RPM spindle, but we have a big range. It's starting with 12,000 RPM, 15,000 RPM, 20,000 RPM. Really depends on what the application of our customers is. So ultimately, you're saying that you've got a five axis machine that's so flexible. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And this is uh, this was what our customers love about this machine. You know, uh, a lot of our customers are setting up the, uh, the machine a couple of times a day and they need flexibility. They need good accessibility to the machine and also a very important point here is for this machine, actually for all our machines, is the small footprint we can offer. You know, you get a lot of strokes, a lot of capability, precision, uh, roughness of the, of the machine, um, but also on a, on a small footprint. So Robin, yeah. tell me this then, if someone was going to buy or someone is looking for a five axis machine, why choose your spinner and the U630 over any other brand? Well. Uh, one big point is that uh, a lot of the main components which go in those machines, uh, you know, a spindle is very important, the uh, precision of the 5-axis table is very important. And we not just buy that stuff, we design it and build it ourselves in our factory in Germany. So why does that help the end user then? Well, you get it at a better price point, for example. Um, you get it with the latest technology, we can adapt to the customer's needs. Um, yeah. And you've added the Robobox onto it as well, Oh yeah, we've got the Robobox here. Um, we can put a lot of automation, uh, different automation styles on the machine. But I have my colleague Dominic with me and he will tell you more about it. Dominic, why have you gone for the Robobox with the Spinner U630? Because it's a very compact solution for the spinner machine. It's on the side of the machine. It's only three square meters footprint, and we have four square meters storage place inside the box. Is it flexible? Yeah, it's very flexible. Usually, automation, the most people think it's for high volumes. But on this machine, we can mix up the parts and we can go to low batches down to batch size one. And how does it integrate so well with the machine? It integrates perfect because it's on the side of the machine. So you have the front door for the operator. If he works at day on the machine manually and at night you can use the robot from the side. And how do you deal with different sizes of components in the drawers then? The big advantage of the Robobox Extreme is that we don't have pneumatic crippers as usual. We use the, the, the clamping device as a gripper. So the robot connects to the clamping device and uses the clamping device as a gripping system. So how does it integrate with the machine? 
And on the machine we have a standard zero point clamping system, so we can load each clamping device direct in the machine and the robot is stripping the part with the clamping device. So we are very flexible. So ideally this is for the unmanned run? Yes, but because the robot is on the side of the machine, you have a free entrance to the front door so the operator can run the machine also on, on day shifts manually and at night with the robot. That's the hardware, but how about the software? Yeah, the software is challenging because to, to automate batch size one is difficult. But we developed a special scanning system so the operator just has to scan the position in the box and his worksheet and then it fits together and it's running automatically. So ultimately, why should someone invest in a robo box on the side of a five-axis spinner machine? Five-axis machine is a big investment for the customer and the customer needs this machine to run the most day and night. So the robot is a good solution to keep the machine running 24 hours.